He once said, I believe because it is absurd. There's a terrific perversity to that too, but that's the kind of a guy that's not willing to cut any sort of compromise between Athens and Jerusalem. Biblical belief comes first, and it is exclusive of all other beliefs. The Lord thy God is a jealous God, thou shalt not have strange gods before me. The idol of reason is a strange God. So for that reason, the moral man will, will pursue morality with a passion, not on the basis of some cogitation, but because he has made the criterionless choice. He has chosen the or rather than the either. Why did he do it? There's nothing to say. This is what he's chosen. Simply on the basis of my own, what he calls, leap of faith. How will we jump across this criterionless barrier? You must make the leap of faith, and there's no way of telling whether you will make the crossing safe. This is the best that human life has to offer. The simple, primary commitment to righteousness, independent of pleasure, independent of rationality, independent of any possible alternative.